What's happening, YouTube? Welcome back to the channel. It's time for an overall crypto market update. So here's what I see right now with the overall crypto market. We're kind of in a holding pattern, and that's exactly what I'm doing right now. I am holding, staying pat, and uh, enjoying Lake Tahoe for the weekend. So I'm not doing anything crazy right now, and there's a couple reasons for that. Number one, we just had a big dip. Now we have to see where the bleeding stops, right? And I don't want to make any crazy decision right now. It looks like the bleeding has stopped, but we don't know for sure, right? We, we, we have to give it some time and see if this is our last stop, right, on the way downwards. I think it is. Um, now, looking at Bitcoin, we don't want to breach that $21,000 level, right? That would give us a sign that we could be heading back to yearly lows. When I look around the market, though, I made a video last night about Cardano. Great opportunity. Polygon, less than 80 cents. Great opportunity. Obviously, Bitcoin, Ethereum. There are still opportunities if you've got, a mo if, if you've got money and you want to inject it into the market right now. But personally, what I'm doing is holding steady, holding pat, because I'm not quite sure that we're out of the woods yet, right? We don't know. We just don't know. And the thing is, we don't want to go ahead and inject all of our money, all of our liquidity into the crypto market now, and then we dip lower, right? That's the thing. Because here's the thing, you can always dollar cost average, always. It's always a good strategy. But if you're looking at trying to time it a little bit, I would wait, I would wait. Because I don't think the market's gonna start ripping anytime soon, right? If you start to see it go up, maybe one, 2%, maybe that's where you kind of, even 3%, maybe that's where you kind of start to inject some of your money. Maybe we're gonna get back up to that $24,000 level for Bitcoin, maybe 25. That's really what I'm seeing right now is the whales are manipulating the crypto market, meaning there's not enough retail money coming into crypto so the whales can continue to kind of play their games. That's exactly what is happening right now. So there's been a ton of profit taking from the high wallets, right? And Shiba Inu, there's been a ton of profit taking from people swing trading Bitcoin and Ethereum. But if you're a retail investor and you're looking to just add to your positions, right? It's kind of a tough market to do that. It is kind of a trader's market. Um, personally, I'm not much of a trader, so I don't try to time it perfectly. I do trade a little bit, right? A little bit here and there. I don't try to time the bottom though perfectly. If I get near the bottom, that's good enough for me, right? Because there's an old saying, it's not about timing the market, it's about time in the market. And that's my philosophy. I'm a long-term crypto holder. I'm a long-term crypto investor, just like I am with stocks, right? So that's how I'm playing my cards right now. I'm kind of just waiting this out, holding. We're steady today. We're, we're still pretty flat, nothing really brewing. I'll continue to kind of monitor the situation. If things change, obviously, uh, we, we react to that accordingly, right? So thank you so much for popping in. I appreciate it. Have a fantastic weekend, and I will see you all in the next video. Take care.